What's up everybody, Jason for Vasa Productions. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to quickly and easily keyframe your audio inside the edit tab of DaVinci Resolve. Coming up. All right, let's show you how to quickly add keyframes manually for audio within speaking parts of your footage or even music to make this go really fast for you using a keyboard shortcut. So I've got my footage right here. I've got the intro of my video here. Let's bring this down a little bit to enlarge it. I've got this front area. I just wanna chop this off. On my keyboard, I've got V to cut the front off and B to cut the back off my video to shorten that up. You can see we have higher parts of our audio here and then we have lower parts of the waveform for audio. And I wanna bring up some of these lower parts to match the higher parts a little bit better. So on a Mac, you just hold down Option and left click on your mouse to create keyframes right here. You can see that. Left click right here to create those keyframes and then just bring this up if I wanna bring that section up to make it a little louder and to match the beginning a little bit better. I've got another area here that's pretty low. Look at this compared to that area before it. Hold down Option, left click. It's gonna be Alt on Windows instead of Option. Left click on a Mac here with Option and bring this section up. So you create four keyframes and then bring up the middle. Same thing here on this final section right here. Holding Option, left click on my mouse to create the keyframes, bring it up, and I'm able to even out that audio and make it more level compared to the other parts of the audio that are a little bit louder. Now you don't have to do that in the entire thing. Obviously there's things like normalization and EQ and dynamics, but this is a way, sometimes you just gotta go through manually and do this in edits to make your audio a little bit more level and a little bit easier for people to listen to. And just remember again, that's holding down Option on a Mac and holding down Alt on Windows. All right, so that wraps it up for how to quickly and easily keyframe your audio inside the edit tab of DaVinci Resolve. If you found this video helpful or you feel like you learned something today, make sure you smash that like and subscribe button. I'm Jason for Vasa Productions. We'll see you next time.